This is the Nautilus Eco Resort, and it will save the Philippine Sea from dying. This project is the first of its kind, as it promises zero emissions, zero waste, and zero poverty. The Eco Resort's two main architectural entities will be a series of shell-shaped hotels and rotating apartment towers, which are organized in a spiral around a central island and will host the Nautical Center and the Scientific Research Laboratories. The shell-shaped hotels and rotating apartments wind up along two golden spirals, respecting the Fibonacci sequence, which is a perfect symbol for balance and harmony. The facades and roofs combine plant walls and photovoltaic cells to increase the building's thermal inertia, optimize natural cooling, and generate electricity. The rainwater will be reused, while grey water will be biologically recycled in waste stabilization ponds bordering the gardens. There will be 12 small museum hotels in the form of a sea snail that seem to emerge out of the water to the east. 12 small spiral towers of varying heights, containing apartments that rotate to follow the course of the sun. The design is a response to the current environmental state of the country, overfishing, mass tourism, pollution of plastic waste, and toxic products, plus climate change, which present real threats to the health of the Philippine archipelago and the survival of its inhabitants. Corals are dying, mangrove areas are being destroyed, seagrass beds are suffocated by erosion, and vital populations of fish and other marine species are declining dangerously. The structures themselves are based on biomimicry, with forms inspired by the shapes and structures of various ecosystems. The project would be completely built from reused materials and would be entirely self-sufficient in terms of both energy and food. By minimizing its ecological footprint, the experience is centered on the preservation of nature and local urban ecology, while respecting endemic ecosystems and agro-ecosystems. The Eco Resort will also contribute to the well-being of local communities by including them in its planning, development, and operation, and directly support local economic development in the form of jobs and income, plus encourage respect for the archipelago's different cultures. The project will generate funds through crowdfunding for the site's conservation with the Association of Preservation of Fauna and Flora. It is above all a project made to exchange and transmit ecological gestures between the natives and the newcomers. It will ask volunteer eco-tourists to clean washed-up plastic waste from beaches, follow recycling schemes, protect coral crops and restore reasonable fishing. This will allow nature to regenerate and also help strengthen natural protection against flooding. The Eco Resort is purely a concept at present, but it makes us look forward to a better and brighter future. Calabout, the one who designed this project, has a collaborative concept focused on using real-world education to spread the idea of responsible eco-tourism or in his words, a voluntary approach to reimbursing ecological debt. What can you say about the Nautilus Eco Resort in the Philippines? Is it the answer to the current environmental state of the country? Share with us your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to give this video a like and follow us for more amazing videos. Thanks for watching.